go back inside. The Frank Bowl is on the field. Frank, what's going on in there? Well, I've, in got, the building? I've got Royals general manager Dayton Moore and D. Jackson also joins us. Dayton, number one uh, opening day. One more time, you're coming off this time, not the American League Championship. You're coming off a world championship. What's this mean to you? Well, it's a celebration, obviously, opening day, but this this one has more significance, obviously. The fact that, uh, you know, we're going to raise a flag and then have a ring ceremony in another day or so, but, you know, just proud of our players and our organization and uh, excited for our fans. But we're looking forward to getting going here in 2016. Yeah, and I also said you sort of take a matter of fact. I know inside you're churning, but you really do. It's like next thing and this is the next thing as soon as that first pitch is thrown like eric cosmer said a little earlier today that season's in a rearview mirror and it's all about this season it is it is and you know we, we know that um you know we'll have to make adjustments to our roster throughout the year but we trust this group of players and you know they give us they give us uh, they've earned that trust i mean they've gone out and they play hard and uh, they're fun to watch so you know, we're looking forward to getting going Dayton, the community is so important to you and the Kansas City Royals. I grew up playing in Parade Park. You guys are going to change that place into an osmosis of baseball. It's really going to do a lot for the community with the Urban Youth Academy. How did you guys get on board with that? And we had the, the Relay the Way today, and it raised a lot of money for that project. Well, it's, an, it's a very important project, D. It really is. And I, mean, I think baseball is the, the greatest platform in the world to grow leaders. And we're going to be able to come alongside young boys and young girls that have interest in our game. And we're going to be able to, you know, help them you know navigate through a lot of things in life and provide mentors and, and life skills and education and you know through the game of baseball and our mayor james has been terrific the entire community uh has supported our efforts and uh, we're really looking forward to it we've got to get your son robert on one of those teams down there he's a, <laughs> this guy's going to be a big leaguer trust me and uh, you know i know you baseball and the youth is it means a lot to you to to develop not only talent in the big leagues but talent within the youth community it really does. You know, the spirit of our front office from day one is how can we continue to grow the game and make the game great in Kansas City and throughout our region. And, you know, we're excited to, to say that there's more kids playing baseball and softball than ever before. And, you know, it's uh, it's a community, you know, wide effort. It, it's everybody's, uh, you know, uh, efforts to do this. And uh, so we're really excited about it. And, uh, you know, it's, it's going to be a challenge going forward. But, um, you know, we like where we are. And, um, you know, it, it's going to be a lot of fun, this project. Dayton Moore, Frank, I got to tell you, this guy is doing a tremendous job, not just with the Royals, yeah. but with the community and Kansas City in general. So, yeah, and I, and I think that's extremely important to you, and I know it is. You've got to really feel good, too, about this baseball team. you got your core players back. you got Alex Gordon back, which is a big thing for you. Place a couple little parts, but you've got to feel great, and you've done it fiscally, fiscally responsibly. Well, we had great support, you know, from Mr. Glass and their entire family. And he's always told us, hey, look, just put the best team we can on the field. And, uh, you know, we, we were aggressive this offseason. You know, these long-term contracts, uh, oftentimes, as you know, Frank, they, they don't work out right. the way you'd like them to. But, um, you know, we felt it was really important to get Alex back. And we needed, a, you know, a veteran presence in our rotation and Ian Kennedy, somebody could give us innings. Joaquin Soria, you know, it was important to us not having Greg Holland. And, you know, that's really been, you know, the, the strength of our pitching staff, that bullpen and we want to make sure we've got adequate depth there where we can continue to match up late so you know there were some key signings for us and hopefully it works out it's great Dayton I'll tell you what I wouldn't mind seeing baseball in November one more time Let's okay go. all right Frank, thank go you. get thank congratulations thank good luck this season you. you bet Dayton Moore Royals GM gonna throw it back outside to Mike Rhiannon